Hello everyone, this is Ava with Stitching in the Interlake. How's everybody doing today on this beautiful, gorgeous Sunday? Well, not so much here. <laughs> it's cloudy, uh, very overcast, it's cool, I've got the furnace on, it's yeah, yeah, not very good. Well, today I have two special guests with me. I would like to introduce, there's Lily and this is Caden. And these two young people have been coming to the church here. And unfortunately, today, Mass starts at noon instead of 10 o'clock. So I didn't want them walking all the way home. So guys, say hello. <laughs> They're not saying very much. So, all righty. And uh, so I'm continuing to work here on Autumn. And I think I've got two fans here. I think so. So I'm going to continue working on this. And of course, down here is, oops, I forgot to show you. There's Miss Lilybell, Miss Twinkle Toes herself. Yes. Yeah, there she is, the beautiful girl. And Jonah, he's hiding from me right now because he... Yesterday, I noticed that he had a lump on his neck, and I checked him out, and he had an abscess. So, I tried to get it, couldn't get it to open up. So, then this morning, I took a look, because it looked like his neck was down, and he, um, uh, it had ruptured. So, I went to go and get a cloth to clean it, and I just got started on it and it was it had been draining and then he got up and he had enough so yeah he's hiding he, he doesn't want to be bothered by me anymore so uh oh yes um tomorrow um well today actually is the final day to enter into the draw for wheat fields so as you can see, it's this, and this comes from my personal stash, okay? This is a custom made. It is uh, approximately 50 by 60, and uh, that is the finish size. So you still have time to enter this. Now, you must be over 18, you must be a subscriber, and you must use the word wheat fields in a sentence, okay? Singular or plural. So, yeah, so uh, if you're interested in that, I don't know how many people I've got. I've got like 14 or 15 people. And I do now have a random number picker or something. So I won't be able to show it online, but I can, I'll take a picture of the result. Well, maybe I can do it on my iPad and then you can see, okay? And But I'll have to do that before I post my video because I just, it, it, it doesn't work here with my, I can't edit, I can't do nothing. So, I will have to do, um, yeah, we'll, we'll see. I might actually be able to even put it on my iPad, and then we'll see. We'll see. But, uh, yeah, there's been quite, quite a bit of interest in this. So, uh, yeah, so it's... Uh, it's just another blurry day here in central, south central Manitoba. Oh joy, oh joy. So, so I am, as you can see here, I'm working here. I finished up this part this morning. And now I'm working over on this. So I'm working on all that lime green that you see right there. So I'm going to continue working on this. And I'm not sure if I'll get all this lime green done today, but I'm going to give it a good try. So, uh, 
Lily Bell got me up this morning at, what time did she get me up? I think it was 2.30, 3 o'clock again. But I put her out and then I went back to bed. No way am I staying up. No way. But, uh, yeah. So, uh, I've been watching on, um, on Discovery Plus. I've been watching Dr. Pimple Popper. And it's actually, it's pretty good. It's interesting. And it's, um, it's just a very, very nice, um, program but I'm interested in medical stuff anyways because I was a nurse for so many years so it um it's fabulous to watch this and Dr. Lee is so very good with her patients so she's a dermatologist in Southern California I don't know if it's Los Angeles or where but yeah she's got a lot of interesting interesting cases a lot of lipomas so that's fat deposits. And they come all over the place. One lady there, she's got, she had a really big one on the back of her neck. Another guy had one on his shoulder. Yeah, so very interesting. Very, very interesting. So, so what you guys busy doing today? You doing some stitching? Are you baking? Reading? Doing puzzles? Diamond painting, painting. Yeah, so many things to do. So, um, I'm, I'm still reading. I'm over halfway done my book. And, um, it's Christmas Eve Journey by Elise Douglas. It's number five in the series. Now, I don't know if there's any more coming. But that's all that there, that there is for the series so far. Now, now, they do have other books that are the same kind of, of thing with um, time travel. So it's, uh, and that's a subject very near and dear to my heart. So, uh, but yeah, so otherwise it's... Um, Nothing much else is happening. It's uh, just been quiet. Just watching some TV. Um, yeah. So I'm just binge watching Dr. Pimple Popper. So it's... Uh, there's five seasons. And I'm on season one, episode four, I think. So I've got a long way to go. Lots to watch. Lots and lots and lots to watch. So, but, uh, yeah. <clears throat> so, if this cold weather keeps going, it's going to be, it's going to be not a very good growing season this year. And as you can tell, my voice is hoarse again. Ever since I had COVID two years ago. Well, it's almost two and a half years ago. And when I lost my voice and had severe bronchitis, it's a good thing I didn't get pneumonia. But, yeah, not, not very good. So it gets hoarse and, and that, but you know the routine. So, oh, we have two new um, members on the Facebook group. Don't ask me what they are because I don't remember. And, but I did put them on the Facebook group. And we do have a few new subscribers on the YouTube group. So, that's wonderful. I'm up to 366 Yes, 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 yes. I love it. I love it. Um, so stay tuned this week. On Wednesday, I'm going to be doing another 
review for one day saving. I did yesterday I did a review for VIPCrossstitch.com. And I believe on that was Saturday. On Thursday. Th yeah, I believe it was Thursday. I did a review uh, from Art Create Love with the paint by numbers. So, yeah, it's wonderful that these companies are interested in my channel. And I thank them for their support. So, uh, but yeah. So yesterday I didn't get to watch Laura again. I'm sorry, Laura. I just, I don't know. I just forget the time. And, and then before I remember, it's like, um, it's already over. So, um, but I'll go back and watch it. So, not a problem. Not a problem. So, uh, yeah, but, um, anyways, not much else is happening. Just Jonah, I wish, I wish Jonah would come out and let me take a look at his neck, but he's got a puncture wound in the side of his neck for sure. I could see it. And at least it's draining now. It had grown quite big. It was about like that size, his abscess. And I was going to take him up to Ashern, but I'm glad that I don't have to because it's extra driving and I don't have the money for a vet. I just, I'm, I'm broke. I'm below broke. I'm just, <laughs> I'm going backwards instead of forwards. So, uh, yeah. So it's nice when you all, you, um, comment on my videos down below. And, um, to, um, tell me how you're, how you're doing and what you think of my videos and and if you're just new here please tell me where you're from and how you found out about me because I would be very interested in knowing those details because I'd like to see where my audience comes from and uh What's the reach of my audience? Like, do you live in Canada, in the U.S., in the U.K., Europe, Australia, New Zealand, South America, wherever it is? And uh, I know I have one lady, and she is... No, I, there's two ladies, and I haven't spoken to the other one for a while. But Sadipta is from India and that's um, that's very nice to uh, to have people from there now Sadipta you were saying there that you were going to order from um, what was it VIP cross stitch did you do that and if so what did you order? Can you please let us all know? And remember to um, really focus in on those discount codes. Okay? And make sure you get the discount codes correct. Because um, every time that you use the discount code, I get recognized. Not not monetarily but I get recognized and then they know the reach of my channel so 
which is wonderful. But, uh, yeah. So, uh, otherwise, today is just going to be a stitchy day. I didn't paint. I'd like to maybe try and paint a little bit. Just to do maybe one little square or something on my, um, the one I'll be known for Christmas. And, um, yeah, I think that the clear gesso is going to make a difference in the canvas and how the canvas absorbs the paint. So it will be a uh, very interesting um, to see how this one eventually turns out. Now, I don't have much of a steady hand. And, um, you know, I don't, I don't see all that well. And there's a lot of little corners and everything. It looks great. But I don't know. I think mine's just going to turn out to be a big blob. <laughs> so, uh. But, yeah, there's just, um, just not much going on. And, um, it's, uh, just quiet. Lily Bell here is enjoying her spot here. And, uh, yeah. So how are you guys feeling today? Anybody sick? Um, you know, uh, what's the weather like where you are? Um, uh, it's just not pleasant here. I think this morning it was like 7 degrees or something. Thankfully, so far, there isn't rain, but it's extremely cloudy and windy so that just kind of makes it a little bit more on the miserable side and harder to deal with so um but yeah so uh Yeah, I'm looking forward to doing my my last review for One Day Saving on Wednesday. I've got three new kits there to show you. And it should be, I hope you like it. So, it's, uh, I'm interested in them. I think they're cute. But by far, so far, the one that I love the best <laughs> is my gnome welcome. I love that. I love that guy. <laughs> He's so cute. He's so cute. I don't know why. I'm All of a sudden, I'm interested in gnomes. But it's either you're interested in them or you're not interested in them. You know, I'm not one much for kitsish stuff you know like nonsense stuff but if um there are some that are just too cute too cute yes i'd like to try and get some more of those gnomes but i have to be careful because there's only certain ones that i do like and, of course, there's not a lot yet in the cross-stitch part. There are a lot in the diamond painting department. So, if you're interested in them, yep. I think you've been able to see what, what my, where my interests lie in things. Like, I, I like that, um diamond painting from Diamond Art Club, Nefertiti, that I'm doing. And, um, yeah, there's just, there's just all different kinds. All different kinds. 
so it's um yeah it it just it has to strike my fancy now they can go from this size to monster sizes and um you have to really enjoy doing them and remember when you order diamond paintings or cross stitch size matters so don't expect to get something that's really 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 busy in a small peak like this no because you're not going to get clarity it's just going to be so pixelated that you won't be able to see what it is you are much better off to spend the money and buy a larger size and to have it look right than to have a smaller size and it just ends up in the corner. Yeah, not good, not good. So, so usually when I order the um, custom cross stitch, I order bigger sizes. Because I want that, I want that, that look. I want that, um, you know, so that you can see the details. Right, so. But, yeah. Hmm. I guess when I come home, I'll have to do my dishes and uh, I may do a load of laundry. I don't know yet. I'm just hoping Jonah shows, comes out so that I can look at his neck again. It's, uh, it drained quite a bit just in the last, when I was able to get it. You just press on it. And it oozes out so it's better out than in I can tell you that so I'm just finishing off this little bit on this scarecrow's hat and then I will show you and I'm really I'm really quite surprised at how nice this is looking it's a nice, simple, easy stitch. And it's a fast stitch. And it's nice when you can finish up one. Now, as you know, I did my Autumn Lady, and that was my first finish for this year. And this is, this will be my second, because I'd like to get it done and out of the way. So, all right, everybody. So let me see here. I've got this one. I've got this one here. So, almost finished. Okay. Alrighty. So, as you can see, I've got the hat done now, and I just have this here and the bit of the border to do, and the leaf here, and that. Not much left in this green. I could possibly get that done today. So, and then I can move on to another color. So, very, very fast and easy stitch. Um, you know, it doesn't take long. This is a great beginner's, very good beginner's stitch. So, anyways. All right, everyone. So, from Lily and Caden and from my Twinkle Toes herself, Miss Lily Bell, and myself, Ava with stitching in the interlake. So, may you be happy, may you be healthy, may you be well. May God bless you this day and every day. God loves you, and so do I. And so, I guess I will see you 
tomorrow, God willing. Toodle-oodles, everybody!